since it's Halloween today, we're going to be making Halloween themed pottery. I'm going to be making a teapot in the shape of a pumpkin, and and I'm going to be making a carved jack-o'-lantern, but it's made out of clay. So right now, I'm going to throw just the base, the main body of my pumpkin teapot. So it's been a few minutes, Elsie let it dry so she can take it off now. And what do you think of how it turned out? I think it turned out good. I'm going to go ahead and cut it off now. Oh, the base is look so at that. Thick. that. Definitely cool. needs to be trimmed. Yeah, it needs to be thinner. Trimmed for sure. I'm just going to do the spout, just with a little piece. Quick Halloween spider. <laughs> Hopefully it's up. So she's just measuring, just so she knows how big to make it. This is already getting hard. So this might need to. You made covered. one extra lid right there, and now what are you gonna do? You're gonna start doing like the little handle for the lid. Yeah. Okay. So now I'm gonna throw my little pumpkin. Here we go. Here it is, all done. I'm actually really happy with how the shape turned out. So, the only thing I'm a little bit worried about is the base. But, I think it's gonna be okay. So here's all these little teapot all trimmed. So first she's gonna shape it like a pumpkin, then she's gonna attach all the accessories. And my little pumpkin is still pretty wet, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna let it dry for a while longer. I'm just working on getting the nice shape in the pumpkin. She made lines all around just to mark where she's gonna put the indentations. Okay. Sorry about the loud lawnmower. Here's a quick update. It's coming along pretty well. I'm about to start trimming mine. Okay, so Elsie didn't really show you how she did hers, so I'm going to show you how I'm going to do mine. This is my lid, by the way, I was just working on. It still needs to be smoothed, but this is the general shape. So. As you can see, the base is nice and smooth. I just trimmed it, and now I'm just going to make some lines. I'm just going to continue working on kind of shaping these little cre creases, making it a little bit more round. I'm done shaping it. This is how it turned out. And now I'm gonna carve it. <laughs> Here it is. Ah, oh, the smile's a little weird. I did my best. This is the lid. It has to have a little hole because it's hollow. It's inside. Elsie's back. So Elsie's just using a spoon to apply texture to her pumpkin. Yep. And I'm just tapping it like this. Okay, as you can see, Elsie attached the spout. I mean, not the spout. Elsie attached the handle. Now she's going to attach the spout. Here's Elsie's completed teapot. 
It's pretty glorious. Turned out super good. The little lid. Yeah, so. Very nice. For now, it's finished. We'll probably do a glazing video in like a week or so. Just to show you guys what the final result is. This is mine. I already showed you earlier, but there it is again. So I hope you enjoyed this video and our little pumpkins that we made, and please subscribe. Hopefully it's- Oh, get away! <laughs> Why'd you throw it? I nearly just bit me. I don't like spiders, by the way. <laughs>